Hey everyone, Caffeine Man here, and today we are going to be going over another new drink on the market. This drink came out just over a month ago, and it's got a lot of people excited because this brand has some very solid energy drinks and slightly healthier than some of your other common energy drinks due to the ingredients in it because it actually uses fruit juices and lots of other great ingredients. And that brand is Bing, and that flavor is the new Bing Blue. Coming right up. Hello again, everyone. Thank you so much for joining me today. And if you want to stay informed on all things caffeine related, feel free to hit the subscribe button. I post new videos every Tuesday night and one on the weekends. And stay tuned this weekend when I will be doing my monthly live stream. It is a little late this month just because I was on vacation last week. So I had to postpone it for a week. But it is going to be coming up on Saturday at 7 p.m. Eastern time. Normally I do try to do them on Sundays, but it is football season. And I do understand a lot of people want to watch their football games. So for the football season, I'll be doing all my live streams on Saturday. Saturday instead and once football season is over I'll be jumping back into doing them on Sundays and the live stream that is coming up on Saturday is gonna be an unboxing of the zero pack box program it is a subscription box where they send you five sugar-free energy drinks to your door and if you are interested in this box you can actually save 50% off yes 50% off your very first box when you use coupon code caffeine man that is five sugar-free energy drinks for like 10 bucks not including shipping. But if you're looking to find out more, check out the zeropack.com or I'm actually going to include a link down below to a video that I did showing you the first eight months of boxes to give you a better idea of what is in this program. Or you can just check out my live stream this Saturday at 7 p.m. Eastern. I also do a question and answer at the end of the live stream. So if you've got any questions for Caffeine Man, be sure to stop by. I do want to give a big thank you and shout out to Energy Drink Josh for sending me this drink. I really do appreciate it. Check him out at Energy Drink Josh on Instagram. He posts pictures of energy drinks almost every single day. You're bound to see something you haven't seen before. If you don't have Instagram, you can check him out on Twitter. If you don't have Twitter, I'm not sure what to tell you. And while you're there, if you have Twitter, Instagram, or Facebook, you can also check me out at Caffeine Man one But this isn't about me. This is about a thank you to Josh. Thank you to Josh. And in today's video, we're going over the brand new Bing, Bing Blue. What exactly is Bing Blue? It is their energy drink made out of blueberry and boysenberry juice. Yes, that's right. It is actually made out of juice, not just artificial blueberry and artificial boysenberry flavors, actual juice. So first off, I am briefly gonna tell you what is in this drink because it does have a few different ingredients than the original line that they have. And then we'll jump into the taste test. Timestamps and chapters down below so you can go where you wanna go. Bing Energy is made by Petey's, and they actually started off with a straight up cherry flavor. And like I said, it's not just cherry flavor, it is actually made with cherry juice. So you're getting a nice solid actual cherry flavor out of that drink. And they were one of the first companies to actually use cherry juice in their energy drinks. As they rose in popularity, they also came out with several other flavors, including a blackberry, a raspberry, an apple flavor. And if you want to know more about how those drinks taste and all the ingredients in those drinks, as well as a little more history behind how this company got started and grew to where it's at today, be sure to check out the first video that I did where I go over all that information. And since I went over all that information in the first video, we're gonna go ahead and talk about what is in this drink as some of the ingredients are different. So let's jump right into the nutrition facts panel and ingredients. Similar to the original line, you're gonna be getting 30 calories out of this can, 10 milligrams of sodium, you're getting nine grams of carbs. And when you look at the breakdown in the sugar, you're gonna be getting six grams of sugar as well as four grams of added sugar. And that added sugar is coming in the form of pure cane sugar. Similar to the original drink, you're gonna be getting 100% of most of your B vitamins, 2% or your daily value of potassium, 100% or your daily value of vitamin C, and unlike the other drinks, you're actually going to be getting 75% of your vitamin D. So yeah, like I said earlier, this is a little bit of a healthier drink because it is packing a punch with all these vitamins. Not just your B vitamins, but your C vitamins, your D vitamins, and vitamins all over the place. Plus lots of great ingredients. Let's go ahead and talk about those ingredients. Now, when we go ahead and we take a look at those ingredients, look at that second ingredient. That's right, the second ingredient is blueberry juice and boysenberry juice. That means because it's the second ingredient after carbonated water, that is the ingredient that you're gonna be getting the most of 
out of these drinks. And they also have some Asian ginseng, just like the original line. Now, unlike the other drinks, these drinks actually contain L-theanine. Yes, L-theanine, that excites me very much. Not sure how much it excites you guys. If you guys like nootropic energy drinks, then you should be excited too, because I am a huge fan of nootropic energy drinks, and L-theanine is one of the top ingredients for nootropics, because it is also one of the top ingredients for mental focus, concentration, as well as many other brain functions. <laughs> Love me some L-theanine, and additionally, L-theanine is also known to help with stress and anxiety. Now, I don't actually use it for that. I use it for its focus and concentration, plus a clean energy from energy drinks. But I do know someone else who does use it for that. In an article in 2019 in Elle magazine, Taylor Swift said she uses L-theanine to help with her stress and anxiety. But when I heard that, I had to call her up and say, listen, I know that you're stressed out and anxious, but you know, it's probably because of all those haters and, and you know the haters are gonna hate, but don't worry about it because I could build a castle out of all the bricks they threw at me. That's actually, that's a pretty good inspirational line. I hope it helped her out. This drink also contains sucralose to give it just a little bit of extra added sweetness. Let's taste it out. Just gonna grab the can of Bing from my caffeine man fridge. And as you may know, if you watch that first video that I pointed you to, Bing started off as a very small company and slowly grew into a bigger company. And it's great to see that happen when you have a very solid energy drink. Another small company that is starting to grow that has solid energy drinks is Blakestar. I've done numerous reviews on Blakestar. I am a huge fan of their pineapple coconut and their wild cherry, but I think all their flavors are very solid. And if you wanna find out more about them directly, you can check them out on Instagram where they have lots of different contests and promotions going on. Or you can check out blakestar.com and save 10% off your entire order when you use coupon code caffeine man. Plus they also offer free shipping. So it is a great way to get your hands on some energy drinks, fairly cheap. They even have variety packs. And here is the can. And they really do go above and beyond telling you everything that's in this drink. They really want you to know what's on there so that you are interested in buying it. I mean, right on here, it says Bing Blue made with blueberry and boysenberry juice, B vitamins, vitamin C, caffeine, and ginseng beverage with vitamin D and L-theanine. All that right on the front of the can. Talk about upfront and honest. Let's taste it out. A nice dark blue, and I'm actually gonna call it purple. A nice purple color there from uh, all the fruit juices that they put in there. Give it a little sniff. Smells like berries, smells like natural berries too. So will be interested to see how the flavor is. Cause usually when it comes to my energy drinks, I usually kind of like the fake sweet fruity flavors, but if they could do a nice balance between a nice natural berry flavor with a good amount of sweetness, I'm usually a happy man. Let's taste it out. All right. All right, <clears throat> that, that is really good. I mean, it's almost like I'm predicting the future because I was saying if it could give you that natural flavor and listen, natural blueberry in your energy drinks usually doesn't taste all that good, but you gotta add enough sweetness to it where they added just the right amount of sweetness to it that you're not getting that earthy, crunchy natural flavor. You're getting a nice solid natural flavor, a nice amount of sweetness in there and just a good flavor. So first off, let's start off with all the information I normally go over. For your carbonation, you're getting a, a medium carbonation out of there. Uh, I don't think they're going too high with it, which I'm a fan of. And for your sweetness, this is where it gets interesting because uh, I think they're giving you a medium to, to, to maybe medium high sweetness. Uh, you know, I'm gonna go back in because I, I the, the thing is it's got a little bit of tartness in there too. So you know how your blueberries give you a little bit of tartness? You're getting some tartness, which is pulling back on the sweetness. So you get hit with this bit of sweetness and then you probably noticed it when I was drinking it. I got hit with that tartness. I was like, whoa, hey, where did you come from? Let's, let's, let's hone in on the sweetness as opposed to the tartness. I'm gonna go, it's got a medium sweetness to it. And it really is a great amount of sweetness while still keeping that natural blueberry flavor. So let's talk about the flavor profile. I am gonna tell you, this has a high flavor profile. If you guys are looking for a good blueberry boysenberry drink, they are really giving you a solid flavor here. Like I said, right before I drank it, I think they're giving you a perfect amount of natural flavor 
balanced out with a certain amount of sweetness, just a medium amount of sweetness to give you a really great tasting beverage. There aren't a lot of boysenberry flavors out there, but I really think there should be because from the ones that I've tried, they've been pretty good. And this is no exception. And it's gonna be difficult putting on the Caffeine Man rating chart because um, it's not a blue raspberry. So I don't wanna compare it to all the blue raspberries out there, but because I don't think that's fair. Blue Raz is a specific flavor and there's a lot of competition with a lot of blue razzes out there. This is not your blue razz. This is definitely more of a blueberry and boysenberry flavor, just like the name says. So I'm gonna put on the Caffeine Man rating chart, the boysenberry flavors and the blueberry flavors. And maybe a few mixed berry flavors too that might not be considered blue raz and when we look at the caffeine man rating chart like i said not a ton of competition i'm gonna give this a 9.2 that's right a 9.2 it is actually my favorite of all the bing flavors and i really think that it is a really really great flavor Thank you so much for joining me today. I really do appreciate it. If you guys are looking to pick these up, I know that you can get them on their website at bing.com or bingenergy.com. Uh, whatever it is, I'm sure you'll be able to find it. But if you're looking to find them in stores, check out your local grocery store. I know that they are in a lot of different grocery stores. I don't know what you have near you, but they might be in Kroger. I don't have any Kroger's near me. I do know that they have them in Shaw's near my house. And they also have them at some of the other smaller independent stores. I know we have an IGA that carries them. And, and like I said, you'll find them in usually the fruit section section like the fruits and vegetables section because they usually don't carry them in the energy drink section but to the best of my knowledge they are in a lot of grocery stores not usually your convenience stores and thank you again to energy drink josh for sending me this drink i really do appreciate it check him out on instagram and twitter at energy drink josh so until next time guys have yourselves a great day or night But on the Caffeine Man rating chart, I'm actually going to put a couple of Bing flavors up there too to show you all the scores. Nah, I'm not going to put the Bing flavors up there. Scratch that. They can go watch the other video. <laughs> Should I use that for an outtake? Scratch that. They can go watch the other video. Yeah, that's right. Go watch the other video. Give me some more views. Caffeine Man.